Okay, here we go. We should be live on the right place now. I'm totally blaming jet lag, but in actual fact, it's just me and my crazy brain at the moment. I'm telling you, I'm losing the plot. I had all these different people going, um, why haven't you got this event organized? And there was like three different things I hadn't organized. I'm like, oh my goodness, I'm totally dropping the bundle. By the way, it's Kylie Batucci, Stampin' Up! Demonstrator in Australia here with you. And if you're a bit like me and you're feeling very frazzled and all over the shop, then you've joined the club. Yes, the craziness is real. It really is. It's really happening. Yay, I'm on the right page now. Welcome. Please jump in, comment, say hello. Love to hear where you're watching me from, where you are in the world. Isn't it amazing that we can all just come together? Hello again. Hi. Oh, you found me, Nancy. I'm so happy. Yes, I'm very happy you found me. Julie's here. Hi, Julie. Hello. Yes, so there's a lot going on with Stampin' Up. Are we excited about the sale? I know I am. I know my customers are because I've been getting a few orders today and I'm very excited to see those. Today is the start of the designer series paper. Hashtag love it, chop it. So that's our first promo today. And also the cardstock. I know I'm going to be stocking up on my cardstock. And also embellishments. We all love a bit of an embellishment, bit of bling. Add a bit of a pearl rhinestone or a, no, a pearl or a rhinestone. They are separate things. Um, but I've noticed that a few are saying, how can I combine my order so that I don't have to pay postage each day? Now, one thing that I think Stampin' Up! have looked at is the amount that we spend usually per order and what it means for you as a customer and even us as demonstrators. So the exciting thing as a customer in Australia, all you need to spend is $59.50 and basically you're getting free postage. So I know for me, if Stampin' Up! released a sale and said, free postage today, how would you react? You'd be like, sweet, I'm I'm all up in that. I'm, I'm totally for that. So as long as you spend $59.50, you're getting free shipping, but anything above that is actually a bonus. So I think it's a pretty cool sale. I know that some have been saying, oh, but it's three different days and how do I combine it so I can save on postage? Well, just by spending, you're actually getting the free postage. So I think that's pretty good. Any discount is a discount, right? It's all a good thing. It's stating that some things are out of stock. Actually, Angie, in Australia, I don't know, you're in Australia, aren't you, Angie? I get very lost. I'll blame my jet lag on everything. But in Australia, there was a bit of a glitch that when they were doing um, when they were doing the update for the sale, it suddenly turned off some items altogether. So that is a little bit of a drama because a few of my girls in my team were like, oh my goodness, there's no tremor anymore and there's none of this. And But it's just a glitch with the Stampin' Up! system that hopefully our new IT man is going to get on top of. Yes, ask for a host code. Do you want my host code that's happening at the moment? I'll put that up. I'll, in fact, I can even type it in. Isn't this brilliant with this new system? I'm like loving this. Is that the right one? I think so. Yes, it is. I think. <laughs> I'm like, let me just go over to my blog and just make sure it's the right one that I've put in there. <laughs> So, yeah, if you ever need it, I will actually switch to this so that you can see it. Yes, it is. So, let me go to my page and let me insert my little head in here. Because, you know, we just want to keep seeing each other. I don't want to disappear just yet. So, I think that's that's happy over there. Except I don't, I don't like a border. I'm so fussy in some areas. In some areas, I'm like, meh. What ifs? So you can see this is my blog. Welcome to my blog. Come and join me. So you've got all the cool things here, clubs, tabs, 
but you will also always have the host code on my blog. It will always be update and it says current host code and it says November. So you know you're in the right, right month. So that is where you'll always find it. And I put it here as well because then you can highlight it and it makes it easier to add to your basket when you're shopping. So then you'll come over here and do a shop. Got to make sure my name's in the corner. And you can click shop from my page. So click shop now. And voila, you can start shopping. You just have to sign in so that it saves your basket because you don't want to, you know, get called away somewhere and then the basket disappear. So that's all there. And the online extravaganza is right here. So the exciting thing is, remember that you can add other items to your order. If you have some holiday catalog items that you wanna add, so you can see holiday catalog, they are not gonna be on sale at all the whole time. Same with the clearance rack. There might be some cool things in the clearance rack that you wanna add, which will, you know, add some value because you're getting free postage anyway if you spend $59.50 in Australia and so you might add one of them I think someone this morning added some framelits which I think is really clever to add some of these cool framelits that are super discounted and the online extravaganza is here paper and embellishment and you can see there's all these cool things cardstock these acetate card boxes can I just say they are brilliant they're such a good gift to give to people make your cards up don't write in them and just give them a gift of handmade cards I know I'd love that would you not love that how many does it fit hello Carrie oh I like that Jenna yes if you want to get a code that's a very good point so say over the three days you think you may spend more than the $250 so if you want to, you can ask me for your own personal host code. I have no problems with that. You may even find some friends that you want to take an order for and say, hey, did you know Stampin' Up! have a sale? I can get them delivered to my house for us. Do you want to put anything in? And then you may score some cool rewards for telling your friends. So yes, please ask me, Jenna. I can create a host code for you, no problem. And you can share it with your friends and family send a link I can send you my store link or you can even just send them to my um, blog and say click order from here make sure you use the code so there you go adds it has five standard cards plus the envelopes but look how many boxes come in the in the set for eleven dollars and two cents in Australia you get ten boxes bargain what a cool gift ten gifts just done like that you could do love it chop it with your designer series paper that I just hit myself in the head with. So you can get some of the designer series paper. Let's have a look on the online extravaganza and work it out. Because it's just, you know, it's so cool to get good deals. So you could get a cardstock pack and then get the paper that matches. So you can see here, Animal Expedition goes with the paper. So literally, if you have this and this, you will make 72 cards. And then you have your little boxes and that's going to fit five in each. That's 50 cards. So you're still going to have leftovers and you're going to have 10 awesome gifts, cut handmade cards. And then all you need to do is add a sentiment on. We've all got sentiments. I mean, look at, look at our cupboards. We've all got a sentiment somewhere and just a little punch that you stick on the front of your card. So if you're not sure about love it, chop it. I do have my workshop that you're more than welcome to join. I'll um, pop that up on the page actually I'll just move from here hello I'm back again so if you want to chat join my love it chop it club yes there's the link so I've popped that up and you can get all the details about how to use the designer series paper in a very easy way just chop it up so that you're cutting your entire pack of paper and getting getting 72 cards from one pack hello Chrissy good to see you so I did want to announce that we had a winner for the paper pumpkin. Did you see that? And you know what? I've gone and left it on my phone who the winner is, but I, I'm hopefully going to look at it and be like, yes, that's the person. That is the person that won. <laughs> 
Jesse, stop messaging during my live. You should be watching me. Instead, I'm getting your pop-ups of Jägermeister. <laughs> Jesse's going shopping. So, yeah, I was given a very beautiful gift from Deborah Rice. She's so sweet. And what better than to share this beautiful gift? She gave us so many presents. It was ridiculous. She looked after even Jesse. You might have seen the picture with all the tassels. That came from Deborah Rice, which was so cute. We got so many presents. Actually, Bruno, if you're there, can you bring in our presents of all our peanut butter M&Ms? <laughs> oh, so good. I was like, are you kidding me? Is this for real? Like, the amount of gifts that we were given, we were just so overwhelmed and so excited like it was so sweet of everyone to come up and say hello to us at on stage in Orlando and yeah quite humbling really it was like are you for real stop giving presents I meant to be giving you things <laughs> oh thank you Andre oh, I'm so glad I hope you can get lots of inspiration and a bit of craziness too hopefully hopefully you all relate to the mentalness Seriously, I'm losing the plot this week. And I want to blame jet lag, but I don't actually know if it is. I think it actually might be just me that I have literally lost the plot. <laughs> My brain's gone, overload, overload, cannot handle anymore. Not Bruno Jesse. <laughs> yes, I love peanut butter M&Ms too, Chrissy. Hi, Randy. Good to see you. So... While Bruno hopefully brings in some peanut butter M&Ms to show you, I have some other things here to show you. Oh, Bruno sent the picture. <laughs> He's like, I'm not coming in with peanut butter M&Ms. Here's the picture. <laughs> well, the best thing is that because I have, <laughs> because I have switcher, I can actually show you the picture. <laughs> there you go. There's the picture that Bruno just sent me via Messenger. <laughs> Thank you for bringing those in, Bruno. I'm really excited that you sent them to me. <laughs> but that is seriously what we were given. And some of these packets, I'm telling you, are like huge. They're party, party share. And funny story, there was one demonstrator that approached me. And I wish I got photos of all of you just to personally thank you. But... Please take this as a big thank you to every single one of you. I actually wasn't prepared to write names and keep track of who gave us what because it was literally so overwhelming. And now I'm kicking myself because I really want to thank each of you personally. But please take this as our thank you. We really did not expect it. And we're so grateful. A lot of you said that you were inspired by Love It, Chop It!, some of you were saying that you were inspired by the Random Act of Kindness group. Some of you were in our training, demonstrator training group. And it's just amazing. Some of you follow our blog. And it was, yeah, really sweet to hear that we are doing things that are inspiring you to use your product and share what you love with other people. We, we're really, really excited by that. So thank you. Oh, it took you three hours to make a coffee card yesterday. Thank you, Jenny. I'm glad it's not just me that's muddled. I have a muddled brain. <laughs> Hi, Suzanne. I'm saying that I'm like really, really jet lagged, but I'm actually feeling okay. I just keep missing things all over the place. So anyway, there's, there's our beautiful M&Ms on this side. Thank you to every single person that gave that. And the story I was going to tell was while I was in front of Brian King, Chatting to Brian, amazing, inspiring person to me. I love his card style, love what he does. And we were chatting and this demonstrator said, I just love both of you. You're so amazing. Thank you so much for your inspiration. And Kylie, here's some peanut butter M&Ms. And then I looked at Brian and went, yeah, I got the peanut butter M&Ms. And then she goes, they're a share pack. So you may share them. And I'm like, I'm out of here, Brian. I'm out of she gave them to me. I'm not sharing my M&Ms. These peanut butter M&Ms, even though I've got like four kilos in my in my um, suitcase, I was probably a little bit naughty. I probably should have said, Brian, this is for you. But I was like, bye, Brian. Nice to see you. I was like, out of there. <laughs> I was like, I'm going. I've got my peanut butter M&Ms and I'm out of here. <laughs> 
Yes, someone gave me Canadian M&Ms too. So I'm very sorry, Brian. I'm sorry I stole your M&Ms from you. She did give them to me first, though. She put them in my hands. So I I'm taking them. I was like, thank you, girlfriend. <laughs> They're mine. I'm out of here. <laughs> so, yes, so that was all the gift. We have so many gifts to show you that it's, like, super exciting. Now, the other thing that I wanted to show you we have the Collect and Win still happening for our lovely customers, and currently it's double vouchers. Now, if you haven't seen Collect and Win, I'm thinking, do I have any Collect and Win here? I don't think I do. But anyway, my lovely customers know what it is. It's basically like Monopoly, but we're doing it with the colour family or the colour collections. So you collect all the colours, you stick them on the PDF that we've created, and you win vouchers. So it's a lot of fun. My customers are having an absolute blast with this. And it's double vouchers at the moment. So just please remember that, that every, is it $25? Yes, every 25, you're getting out eight vouchers now instead of four. So that's more chances to get instant wins, more chances to fill up your PDF. So that's really cool. Oh, Lynn, we had your, your pumpkin um, pie M&Ms yesterday. And I was very confused. My brain was like, what is happening to my M&Ms? I'm tasting cinnamon. But Bruno, he was like, I am taking these away because I love them. He was judging it. He's like, mm, nah, these peanut butter m and uh, these uh, pumpkin pie M&Ms are not going to be good. But he was like, I'm loving these. And Jesse was getting into them too. Yes, we do. We love peanut butter M&Ms because we can't get them in Australia. They're not here. <laughs> I'm surprised we weren't stopped. Actually, good story in, in regards to being stopped. Silly me, and I only actually came back with five of my um, pins. I did um, little badges, pins for random act of kindness and for my training program and also for uh, Love It, Chop It. So I had all these pins that we were giving to everyone that are part of the groups because we're super grateful for you supporting them and silly me I travel a lot like we travel often so every now and then I just make this stupid decision I think Kylie you should know better but I put all of the pins in my carry-on luggage like we're talking hundreds of pins in my carry-on and I was like Bruno I've put the pins on the carry-on. They are not going to let us through. There is no way. They are going. So maybe we've got enough time. Maybe we can go back and ask if we can put it back in our luggage. But I'm thinking, I don't even know if that's possible. Because it's probably underneath <laughs> somewhere on the way to the plane. I was like, oh my goodness. Because we spent a lot of time, Jesse, Bruno and I, making these, these pins, these badges. We get the lady and she's like, whose bag is this? And I'm like, mm. <laughs> hi. And I put on my nicest smile and she opened it up. What are these? And I'm like, oh, you know, they're gifts for my friends. They're like little badges. And <laughs> she's like, yep, no problem. Have a nice day. And I'm like, oh. <laughs> seriously, I could kiss this woman. I was like, oh. How did you let me keep them? I think I must have an innocent face. Thank goodness. And I was very nice. But I was like, oh my goodness, this could have turned into a disaster. I would have been very sad because we spent hours and hours designing them and making them and, yeah, putting them together. But anyway, they got there. So we were very excited to hand them out. Now, I have something to show you. It's just behind me. I've put it together, which I'm very excited about. And you've probably seen demonstrators around the world showing this everywhere. But you know what? I'm showing mine too because it's so beautiful. Look at this bag. So this is our new Stampin' Up! tote bag. In case you haven't heard, this bag is only available to demonstrators right now as a demonstrator order. And it will only... Yes, I totally could have been on border security. They would have been like, ma'am, step to the side. We need to check you. <laughs> but 
But this tote bag is absolutely amazing. Like the amount that it fits in, like punches, stamp sets, you can even put ink. Like it's just absolutely incredible how much you can fit in this bag. And I even saw on one of Janet Wakelin's um, posts or a video that she pulled out the entire section here in the middle that you put together. And um, it fits a big shot. So that was really handy. I thought that's an excellent idea. So if you're one of those people that like to travel and craft and maybe you're even in Australia, we have a lot of people that go in caravans and go traveling. We call them the grey nomads. They're very nomadic and they usually have grey hair or hide it. <laughs> but this would be perfect to bring along with you. And I just absolutely love this gorgeous tag that fits with the 30th anniversary. Look how pretty that is. So if you are my customer and you are thinking, oh my goodness, I am coveting that bag. And I we understand because... Every single order of my customers and my team members that has come through has this bag in their order because they're just like, uh, yeah, I'm getting myself this bag. So you can do one of two things. You can join now and add $235 in your cart of anything you want and you only pay $169. So you're getting $66 of stuff for free plus free postage and included in that could be any of the sale items you could add that to your kit and get it at sale price so it's a really good time and then once you join once you've joined up then you're able to purchase this so that's one option the other option and this is another thing that you could add to your starter kit because you can add anything so this item here is our stamparatus bag so this just goes so nicely with our tote bag. I love that Stampin' Up! are bringing out things like this. This is super exciting to us. But you can add this to your starter kit because this is an item that can be added. I've checked. I had a look. So if you haven't got the Stamparatus, you need that tool. Honestly, it's just the best stamping tool ever. Makes, makes you look like a professional every time. So you can either add the whole thing or just the case. If you haven't got the Stamparatus, it's, it's $135 for the bag and the Stamparatus. Or you can get this on its own. I've forgotten the price off the top of my head, but I will have a look. And the best thing is that you could add that to your kit, your starter kit, which is anything you want. So that's another thing. You can only get this now at the moment if you're a demonstrator, though. So... Good time to join right now, I'm telling you. Now, you can wait until celebration. Of course, there's going to be promotions and amazing things happening during celebration in January, February, March. But I always say to my team, because we're able to order all the brand new products starting from the 5th of December. So the bonus that you get by joining now is being able to get your hands on all the new product early. So... You've got your stamp cleaner in mind. Oh, that's a good idea, Angie. She's got a stamp cleaner in there as well. And Miss Cleaner Bottle. It's very good. You can even put baby wipes if you want to keep your stamparatus clean. So it's a really, really good time to join because the 5th of December here in Australia, we we're able to order from the new catalogue, which is one month earlier than if you wait as a customer. And I'm telling you, being a demonstrator, like you, if you think being a customer is amazing... It's nothing in comparison to being a demonstrator. Next April, Bruno and I are heading to On Stage Live, and that is going to be in New Zealand. We're so excited. We get to catch up with my mum and her husband, have some time together with them, and go to the event. And we're seeing friends as well that live in, in New Zealand, right near the convention centre. So we're really excited about being able to see them and spend time with them as well. Plus, get to all this awesome stuff when we go to these on stage events. So only demonstrators get to go to these events. I'm telling you, you need to be a demonstrator. <laughs> so if you're in another country and you're watching, or even if you're in Australia and you order from another demonstrator and not through me, you need to ask them about the joining. You need to ask them because it's just amazing. I had a girl on my team yesterday she said, because um, I always tell my team, you need to offer the joining opportunity because a lot of people don't realize 
that you have no obligation to sell. You have no obligation at all to stay as a demonstrator, but you do get 20% off all of your purchases and you get awesome stuff like products early and you get discounts and you get promotions and you get so many different things as a demonstrator. So my team member had been a customer for five years with a demonstrator and she was never offered the joining opportunity. And it's gutted her. She's like, I'm so sad because, um, you know, the demonstrator didn't offer it to me. And now I, she joined with someone else. She didn't join with that demonstrator. So please always make sure that you're telling people about the joining opportunity. Hi, Jamie. Good to see you. So yes, tell everyone. Because at the end of the day, they, they can say no. No, we don't want to join. And some of my customers have said that to me. No, Kylie, we don't want to join. We're happy being your customer. And then I keep telling them, all right, I'll take, I'll take your money. I'll take your 20% that you could be saving. No problem. <laughs> that could be given back to you to spend on more things, but that's fine. I'll take it. And they know that I will continue to offer that to them because I know personally that it's the best deal and it's the best offer. And then if they don't want to stay as a demonstrator, they can just come back as being a customer. Easy peasy. There's no pressure. If they feel pressure, they can just say, no, don't want to do it anymore. So please think about it because being a demonstrator is the bomb. It's so good. Look at all this new stuff I've got. Oh, oh, wouldn't have got it if I wasn't a demonstrator. Hi, I'm a customer. No, you don't get any of this. Look at my beautiful new tote bag. <laughs> I love it. Bruno's like, are you going to use it? Probably not, but that's okay because I love it. Because <laughs> I never go out of the house with my craft supplies. But I love it. It's going somewhere where I can display it on a mantelpiece because I'm an avid crafter. <laughs> so that is that. And if you haven't seen it yet, please check out my video about all my product purchase premiere items because they're amazing. All the new things that are coming and the new catalog, like so good. If you love butterflies, I'm telling you, you need to rob a bank because the butterflies are like everywhere and they're beautiful. So yes, check out my product purchase premiere video as well. Now, what else is happening? Random act of kindness. We're doing something very special. I think I've had enough of the admin girls because the lovely Sarah Fleming runs our random act of kindness group because she's the best and she's amazing. I got to meet her in Orlando along with Suzanne and a lot of the girls that run the admin. There's a big group of us that all work together to make sure the random act of kindness group goes well. But we have a very exciting opportunity to support our Heart of Stampin' Up! recipients. So if you want to be part of something really amazing in this new program that Stampin' Up! has started, um, I know Pam Jorgensen, she is going to be raising money for her local hospital and also for cancer research and she will be holding an event and we want to support her. I've been talking to Pam and saying, how can we help? How can we, what can we do to make your event amazing? Because Sarah and Shelley will be at her event and we want to try and lighten her load so that she can enjoy the event and enjoy this amazing thing that she is part of. So please have a look at our Random Act of Kindness group if you're not in it already, because we are going to be doing some pretty cool things supporting our Heart of Stampin' Up! Award. Exciting, right? We all want to be part of it. I said to Pam, we all want to help. We all want to be part of it. So let us help you out. And she's like, sure, I'm up for that. <laughs> so I'll just put the Random Act of Kindness link here. Uh, so this is the group page. And then you just need to request to join. And we will get you in that event page and tell you more details as to how you can help our two um, Heart of Stampin' Up! award winners because we have Pam Jorgensen and we also have Janet Gallion. There's two girls. Now, if you don't know what 
The Heart of Stampin' Up! is, is a special award that Stampin' Up! give to special recipients and it's based on uh, some sort of donation or charity of their choice. So that's really, really exciting. We're really excited about this new program too. So check that out. Uh, Random Act of Kindness, talking about that, we will be doing a blog hop together in the next few days. It's this Sunday. So look out on my blog. I was meant to fix this. Crafty Kylie. But I'm so not getting up because if I get up, you'll see my pyjama bottoms. Because I might look bit business here. No, party. Sleepwear below. <laughs> I've got my flanny pants on. But anyway, this is my craftykylie.com. And if you are OCD, you will be freaking out about this space in between here. It will be fixed after this video, I promise. One of the girls in my video yesterday from my team was like, Kylie, I can't handle it. I can't handle the space between the F and the T. It's doing my head in. So yes, please jump over there. We will have a blog hop this week. We will have other things happening I've got an amazing post. Uh, we got to spend. Yes, I totally have PJ pants. I'll show you. Ta da! <laughs> I think that should be my screensaver. <laughs> PJ pants! <laughs> hey, they're the most comfortable. Seriously, I need to be like chilled, man. I'm like, I don't want to do my live video. I just want to sleep today. And then I'm like, ah, stay in my PJ pants. It'll be like the best of both worlds. Ah, oh, thank you, Bruno. <laughs> the OCD and Bruno is like, I'll go and fix it. No, but you ignored my comment before. Oh, did I? I'm sorry. I said, what's this thing above the sign? What is the thing above the sign? You, you need to show everyone. Bruno's been loving chopping it. Has anyone ever watched the five minute craft yeah, videos? Five minute craft, How many of those videos have you watched? Five minute craft videos on Instagram. <laughs> I just watch them and watch them and watch them. And never make anything. And I thought, you know what? Sounds like Pinterest. I'm going to make something. <laughs> and I made this. Jesse and I, our mind was blown. Are you ready? Yeah, we're ready. Ready to receive. Whoa! What is happening here? Whoa! <laughs> What do you call that, Bruno? It's a turnaround designer series paper star. Nice. Um, I don't know what it's called. It's very cathartic. I'm feeling that that's going to be very And I made it within five minutes. Like, it was so quick. It was a five-minute craft. Not unlike Jamie's five-minute meals that take two hours. Do you remember that Jamie Oliver yes, meal? Yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Okay. Chop it. Thanks, Bruno. Um, did you end up showing your Can pajamas? Can I put it on my head? No. What if I do it the crown? Like, that could be like a crown. <sighs> queen Kylie! I am the love of Chop It Queen! But actually, <laughs> each one of these, because this is six by six paper, <laughs> I didn't cut it at all. No chopping? No chopping. Just loved it. Just folded it. Loved it, used it. I, I was going to use the um, I score crown pack. Bag. I want my crown back. It's so beautiful. I was going to use I feel the... like a princess. Can I talk? No, sorry. I was going to use the score pal. <laughs> not the score pal. The, um, that, you know that thing in that square and it's got all those things on yes. it? Yes, the scoring tool. Scoring tool. Yeah. But I didn't even need it. Wow. I was actually hoping to use the tea paper. Really? I need a scepter. Can you make me a scepter as well? I feel think... like the Statue of Liberty. I was going to say, who are you, the Statue of Liberty? Okay, everybody, bye. <laughs> bye. Thanks for fixing, fixing my F and my T. Who was it yesterday that said they couldn't handle it? I want to shout out to them. Say, it's fixed now. Ah! It's fixed now. Shout out to them. Shout out. Oh, I'm missing my crown. I want to wear my crown now. <laughs> So anyway, I think that's everything that I wanted to show you. I do have some really cool things coming up because it's already getting towards the end of November. So that means a new tutorial bundle. So get your hands on November's tutorial bundle while you can because that's going to be going soon. Um, PJ Princess totes. <laughs> PJ Bottoms Princess. <laughs> Simply scored. Here I am saying scoring tool. Simply scored. 
Thank you. Um, yeah, so <laughs> you're wondering how long it would stay separated. My team know me. They're like, ah, F and T space. I've got better things to do with my time. Like wear crowns. Loved it, used it. No chopping. <laughs> Uh, so, yes, please look out on my blog. Um, my, to my lovely customers, I am calling out to you to come and join the Crazy Crafters team. Uh, I've had some beautiful cards from my team, actually. That's a good thing that I can show now. Where did I put them? Here they are. And I just adore my girls. They're just so sweet. This came from Kate Bernardi. How clever is that how she's used the designer series paper on the dress? And she said, thank you very much for the gifts at on stage and the team gifts because we spoil our team. When they go to on stage, they get lots of prezzies and they give each other lots of presents as well. And a few of the girls went to on stage for the first time and they were very overwhelmed with the love they got. Dear Kylie and Britta, thank you so much for my card and gift at on stage. It was a wonderful day and I enjoyed meeting other crazies. Leslie. Thank you, Leslie. She had an absolute ball of a time. So these are all the special events that only demonstrators get to go to. So to my lovely customers, come and join us because you are going to love it. And this one was from Carleen Rainbow in my team. She said she absolutely loved on stage. How gorgeous is that? And she also said happy anniversary. Thank you. Our 15th wedding anniversary while we were away. So she said, um, we're very lucky to have you as our upline. It looks like you had an amazing time in Orlando. What an amazing way to celebrate your wedding anniversary. It seriously was incredible. What a way to celebrate. So on the day of our anniversary, I'm like, I hope you haven't got me anything because this is, this is it. <laughs> this trip is all we're doing. I didn't even make Bruno a card. I think I'll have to fix that. Note to self. Bruno, you didn't see that. <laughs> I really need to do something because we were just so flat out getting there and making sure the team had all their gifts and everything was organized. So, yes, I was a very slack wife. But, you know, Bruno's very, very kind. So here we go. Just for you. And that was from Alison and she gave us her swap as well, which is super cute. And it's a bookmark and it has a magnet. So that when you clip it together, it goes clip for the bookmark. I really love this idea, Alison. And she has loved it, chopped it too. All the girls love it, chop it. Love it, chop it. So good. I'm loving seeing all this GSP getting used. And um, Alison said, thanks for entertaining me and keep the creativeness going. I'm glad we can entertain you. She gave it to Jessie as well. So thank you, Alison. Super, super cute. Even inside she did the little pears. Yay. So there you go. <laughs> so did I announce, I don't think I mentioned who the winner of the, of the pum paper pumpkin is. We actually don't have paper pumpkin here in Australia. So this is a big deal. A really big deal. I think the UK are the same, which I didn't realise that. I think that the United States are the only people that get paper pumpkin, which is craziness. So the person that won and commented on my picture, that's why you got to make sure you're always following me so you don't miss out on cool stuff, was, drum roll, <laughs> do you like my drum roll? Rebecca Penny, Rebecca Penny. Please message me. I'll message you too. But you have won the paper pumpkin kit. Where did I put it? There it is. So it's from 2017. But there is the paper pumpkin kit. It's so beautiful. Oh, the UK can get it. Oh, that's good. Someone said the UK can't. So we better tell them. You can get it. <laughs> so it's a really great set. It's got the ink spot in there. And that's it there. So that's for you. Uh, no, it wasn't Christy. It was Rebecca Penny. Thanks, Rebecca. Thanks for commenting. I'll send that out for you. And 
I had some other random act of kindness cards, but I think they're on the table out, out where I was photographing them. So I will make sure they're on my blog and I will show them next week. So thank you all for being here. It's so good to catch up. I have a lot of cards and amazing things happening this week. We're getting creating, we're getting busy, particularly with the new things. And just to give you a little sneak peek, I might be doing something with some cogwheels in a silver foil. How beautiful does this look? Looks like it's the real deal. Maybe it could be like Lady Gaga and stick these to my head. Whoops, that didn't stay there very well. Do you like <clears throat> do you like a really interesting face mask and stitch them together? Oh yes. So that's from this. Which they look the same. They look the same as the thin lip. Which one is the thin lip? Which one? Can you guess? <clears throat> and I'm using this beautiful paper here as the background. So please look out for this next week. Lots of inspiration for the new products so that you know what to put on your shopping list for the 5th of December. I'm telling you, this one's amazing. You're going to need it. It actually sold out in Australia. I think it's on back order already. And we don't get anything on back order. So make sure you're getting your order ready for the actual day it goes live. 5th of December here in Australia. I'm not sure if it's the same for everyone else. So thanks for coming by. And make sure you share and make sure you follow. Bye, everyone. Thank you. Have a great day. Happy crafting. Bye.